In this video, you will learn how essential oils are extracted. You may wonder how essential oils are extracted from plants. Four basic extraction techniques exist. Distilling, cold pressing, resin tapping, and absolute oil extraction. And I'd like to cover each of these in detail. Let's start with the most common of all the essential oil extraction methods, which is steam distillation. This process allows us to extract essential oils from very delicate plant materials. During the process, it's critical to control temperature and pressure to avoid burning the oils during distillation. During steam distillation, we place a water bath over a heat source with the aromatic plant suspended over the water. As the water is heated, a steam is generated and rises through the plant material. That steam, now heavy with essential oil molecules, moves into a condensing coil. The condensing coil is warm on the inside, but surrounded by a cool water bath, causing the steam to condense into floral water and essential oils. Because water and oil do not generally mix, a natural separation occurs where the floral water sinks to the bottom and the essential oil rises to the top. The floral water can then be drained and the essential oil is collected and then sent to be decanted and filtered. Another method used to extract essential oils is cold pressing. This technique is specifically used for citrus essential oils and fatty oils. Citrus oils contain delicate citrol molecules that are broken down via steam distillation and become very bitter. Therefore, Young Living does not accept any citrus oils that have been steam distilled, only those that have been cold pressed. Fatty oils such as olive oil, almond oil, jojoba oil, and coconut oil are also cold pressed directly from the plant material. So what is cold pressing? Envision a very simple technique in which you place a very heavy weight on top of a container full of plant material. The heavy weight then presses the natural oils out of the plant material and is in essence cold pressing. A third, less common technique is called resin tapping. This technique is used for a few of Young Living's essential oils, including frankincense, myrrh, and copaiba. During resin tapping, external plant parts are cut, and this allows the internal resin to seep out and be collected. Then, the resin is steam distilled, which gives rise to the essential oils. The final technique is absolute oil extraction. This is the most complicated of essential oil extraction techniques because it requires use of a solvent. A solvent is a substance that helps to dissolve another substance. In the case of some essential oils, the plant material is so very delicate that it would not survive an initial steam distillation. During absolute extraction, we add a solvent to the plant material. The solvent helps to pull the essential oil out of the plant without compromising the integrity of the oil. Then, in order to separate the solvent from the essential oil, a second extraction uses steam to recover the solvent and produce the final absolute oil. The absolute oil is then collected and sent to our laboratory for testing. Absolute oil extraction is only used for jasmine and neroli essential oil. And it's important to note that a trace residue of the solvent may be left behind. So ingestion of these oils is not recommended. However, the solvent that is left behind evaporates very quickly. So jasmine and neroli are perfectly safe for topical application and inhalation. We at Young Living are committed to using the best possible extraction method for each essential oil that we offer. Our proprietary seed to seal process is designed to preserve as much of the botanical's precious chemical profile as possible.